Young Thug has been in jail for about two years. Started trial. Nothing's really been going. I know a lot of people have been saying he's going to come home. The judge, Judge Gainesville was recused because they had a private meeting. Um, in the defense, they weren't, you know, saying privy of this and they should have known the transcripts got leaked. So he got recused. And then they put a, another lady on there, another judge. But then this is Judge Ingram. She recused herself because she was involved with a member. Well, a member. I won't say a member. I think it was a deputy that worked for her was involved with one of the members on the case. So she could be a potential witness. So we'll see. Welcome back. It's coming up on 1215. And we've got breaking news regarding the YSL racketeering case that has taken place for months at the Fulton County Courthouse. Now, once again, the trial needs a new judge. Newly appointed presiding judge Shakura Ingram has now recused herself from the case. The judge cites the arrest of a Fulton County deputy who was once assigned to her courtroom, who was in a relationship with one-time co-defendant YSL Christian Eppinger. Now, even though Eppinger is no longer part of this trial, Judge Ingram ruled she should disqualify herself because the public could question her impartiality. Now, the judge's action follows the removal of providing judge, presiding judge, rather, Euro Glanville from the case. Another Fulton County judge removed Glanville, who was Fulton County's chief superior court judge, after weeks of contention between Judge Glanville and defense attorneys. Right now, there is no word on when a third judge will be appointed or when that trial will resume but of course we will keep you posted of course <laughs> yeah so i mean it's, it's, it's a little bit crazy over here uh let me find a new judge's name but fulton county uh fulton county superior court judge shakura uh, ingram stated in, uh, in the order of a recusal file wednesday morning that her former former courthouse deputy had a romantic Dean relationship with one of the co-defendants christian eppinger because of this relationship, the judge feared it would create an appearance of improper uh, impropriety. Uh, judge Ingram, who was randomly assigned to the case just two days ago at the Fulton County Superior Court, Judge Gainville was accused, requested the case be reassigned. So, I mean, when you really think about it, though, a lot of these judges, the thing is, no matter how many cases they preside over, they don't get paid extra. So yeah, Judge Gainville, he got uh, you know, say recused. He's not on it. This means he gets to chill. Yeah, he was doing some fucked up stuff, but he gets to chill. There's no bonuses. There's no, you know, saying there's no overtime. You're just working these cases, the same boring case over and over and over. Now I know you you're a judge, so you got to be impartial. So we can't call it a boring case because you you're just listening to it and make sure everybody's doing the right thing, but. They've been in court for six months and they haven't got anywhere. They haven't got anywhere. Now you got YSL Woody. He doing dating shows. He doing interviews talking about the case. Now we got to get us a whole new judge in. Let me see. We got to get a whole new judge in. So I don't know how they're going to do it because it's pretty much like a whole new case. So I, you know, they're, they're trying to still get a mistrial, but. I don't know this this judge judge Paige Reese Whitaker. I doubt she's going to be like a hey, mistrial. She's just not getting on it. She's going to want to hear everything. I'm pretty sure she kept up with it, but it's just a whole shit show. This trial is going to last like two years, and even if it is a mistrial, George is going to try it again. I mean, they got a lot of stuff going on, you know, with Trump and his immunity, and how they're trying to go after Fonnie Willis. It's just it's just a lot. But let me see. Uh, what will happen next? Judge Paige Reese Whitaker has now been assigned to handle the case. Judge Whitaker is a former Fulton County prosecutor who also worked at the state attorney general's office. She has been a judge in Fulton County since 17, 2017. Judge Whitaker received a Bachelor of Arts from College of Charleston and her Jewish doctor from Duke. You know, OK, she went to Duke. Her professional experience in associations include Board of Governors for the State Bar of Georgia, Georgia's Women Policy Institute Lawyers Club of Atlanta, past chair to Fulton County Juvenile Court Citizens Review Committee, ambassador for the Pink Ribbon Story Foundation, and sustainer juror, Junior League of Atlanta. Um, 
Uh, let me see. What were some of her biggest cases? Let's see what she. And then Epiger is who the last judge, Judge Ingram, stepped down for. Epiger is currently serving time in Georgia State Prison for shooting a police officer in February of 2022. The status of his case in connection to YSL and Young Thug is currently unknown. So, I mean, it's all kinds of stuff, man. You got. Uh... My name is Judge Whitaker, and I am happy to have a book here to read for all of you as part of Read Across America. Oh, hell no. Hey, look, if she in court talking about she's going to read y'all book, she ain't about to be playing around with Thug and them either. Now, it seems like she's pretty high up there. Sustainer for Junior League of Atlanta. She was on the board of governors for the state bar of Georgia. Oh, yeah. So she know the rules. She ain't just up there BSing. The Lawyers Club of Atlanta. Wherever you go, take your hopes, pack your dreams, and never forget, it is on journeys that discoveries are made. <laughs> this... There will be struggles. There will be fears. And it won't always. They ain't got no. They ain't got no video of her throwing niggas up under the jail. Uh -uh. No way. Well. That's the Young Thug case. I mean, it's, it's really nothing been exciting for me to like just sit down. I watch, I watch the law and crime clips, but it just hasn't been anything that I'm like, man, I want to make a video about. I mean, they just sitting in court. I mean, it is what it is, but they do got a new judge, and we're gonna see what happens to Thug after this. I mean, good luck to that brother. But if he committed those crimes, then you got to do the time. You got to do the time. All right, we got the last body cam footage. We got Amanda up out of here. Let me see what we got. 